the patrons of the internet. Thank you so, so much for tuning in today. Welcome to Tuesday. Did you know that today is Tuesday? As in, it is 2-22-22, Tuesday. Pretty great, right? So in honor of Tuesday, here is what we are going to be doing. We are going to be doing a scavenger hunt. Now, I wanted to get in on the fun, and I wanted to do the scavenger hunt as well. So I have collected all of the items from around my house to show you what exactly I have gotten up to for Tuesday. Now, if you also wanted to be part of Tuesday, you can come into the library and you can pick up your very own scavenger hunt and you can drop it off anytime for the rest of the week. And here's my lovely cat who has just gotten my shot. <laughs> Hope you enjoy. This actually works out perfectly because the very first thing that you need is two animals. So we have animal number one and I'll go find the other one. This is animal number two. This is Fuzzy. All right, we have found our two animals. The next thing that you need to find is two books. That's not a problem in my house. There's plenty of books all over the place. So I chose two of my favorites. This is Esperanza Rising, one of my absolute favorite books of all time, and Where the Sidewalk Ends. The next thing that you need to find is two yellow objects. If you know anything about me or if you've ever come to the library, you would know that I love Pokemon, and so I have Pokemon figurines all over my house. I have a little Pikachu and a Psyduck. The next thing you'll have to find is two items of clothing. Shouldn't be a problem. We wear more than two items of clothing every single day. So I picked out one of my favorite shirts, which has cactuses all over it, and another one of my favorite shirts, which has strawberries all over it. Super fun. The next thing that you need to find is two games. Now, I love to play board games, so I have plenty of those all over my house. So I picked out two of my favorites. This is a Choose Your Own Adventure House of Danger. This is actually a board game that is based on the Choose Your Own Adventure books, which we have plenty of in the library. So if you ever want to read Choose Your Own Adventure, just ask me and I can show you right where they are. The other game that I picked out is actually my favorite game of all time, and it's called Skip Bow. If you've never played this game, I highly, highly recommend it. It's super duper fun. Now the next thing you need to find shouldn't be a problem if you're a healthy eater. You need to find two vegetables. Now I have a very, very tiny onion that I found in my fridge and a kind of sad bell pepper. Take a look at it, it's a little sad looking. Don't worry, that'll get eaten soon. And the last thing you need to find are two toys. Now you'd think that I wouldn't have a lot of toys around my house. You would be wrong. I have a lot of toys around my house. I have a Lorax puppet that my sister bought me a few years ago because when I was a kid I had this itty bitty little Lorax book and I loved it very much and it came with a little Lorax puppet. But somehow between moving out of my parents' house and into my own house, I lost it and I don't know how. So for Christmas a couple of years ago, she bought me a brand new Lorax puppet, which was very, very sweet of her. So I treasure this thing with all my heart. It's really lovely. The other toy was funnily enough also given to me by my sister. And again, if you know anything about me, I love Pokemon. And it's a little it's a little Togepi that actually makes did I not turn it on? Oh, I took the batteries out of it. That's what that's right. But what happens is that if you turn it on and you press its little hands, it actually starts moving. But that's when it has batteries in it, because I took the batteries out because I didn't want them to corrode. So that's it. That was my whole scavenger hunt, and I hope that you enjoy our scavenger hunt for today. Like I said earlier, stop by the library anytime today, and you can pick up your Tuesday scavenger hunt and drop it up anytime throughout the entire week. I hope you all have a fantastic rest of your day. I'll see you later. Bye-bye.